the left to the mountain. Lee, there must be thousands, boats of every kind! Ah! It took the next couple of days to evacuate what we had thought was safe haven. The word had surely gotten to the Japanese scout as to our existence. As we steamed away, we could see the bombing of the temple by Japanese warplanes until we turned around a bend, which struck a few up north before anybody talked. Lee, what happened? Japanese occupation of Shanghai was complete. We knew Nanjing would be next. I went home to get my wife and family. I started to move them out. As I was packing the truck, a bomb went off. I was blown off my feet. I turned around and my house was destroyed. I look around for my family desperately. All I find are body parts of my children. And then I hear a moan as my wife sits half under the house. I try all day to, to, to dig her out and I finally got her out. But she died in my arms from loss of blood. After that, I, I hid and I, I heard Japanese killing people and raping some women. I wanted to die too. But all of a sudden it turned to rage and I got very angry. So I waited till night and then a guard was on patrol. I kill him, I take his uniform. And then I make my way to the edge of the city. I rest there and I fall asleep in the morning. When I woke up, I woke up to the screams of people being marched into ditches, thousands of people being marched into ditches by the Japanese. As some passed, they would cut off their heads and kick them around like balls. <laughs>